step into your job, you. I'm still working, but I'm working under contract. Oh, the, the contract is I, I see the contract finishing. Yeah, end of March. Hmm. Let me say what happened to your job because I see the contract coming to an end and you are afraid now. And that's what has brought you here. Very true. Huh? Yes. I can't hear you. Yes, it's true. Yes. You're, you came here because now you are afraid. As I'm asking, what happened to your job? According to me, I don't see you working anymore. Because these people that are delaying to renew your contract, you're thinking they will renew the. But I, s I don't see you working. Because this contract is coming to an end. So you hear me? You want God to give you a job? Or you want them to renew it? I want God to give me a job. God will do it for you. Amen. I'm sure I don't know you, isn't it? Yes. Huh? Yeah, I don't know you. I'm seeing for the first time. Yeah, true. And how do I know you've got a problem of the job? Is it not Jesus? Amen. Jesus, Amen. Huh? Amen. Amen. The contract is ending and you can't sleep now. Because you are thinking about the support. You are thinking about the support you are having. So now don't worry. Jesus will do it for you. Amen. Do you hear me? Amen. Jesus will do it for you. Amen. Jesus. Omar. You demon. Omar. Omar fam. Sis. Omar fam. Sis. Jesus. Remove now. You're wasting my time. It's you. 
Hello everyone, my name is Laspina Boreni. I'm from Lipopo Malamlele. I hear about charis from my pastor, Mr. Malule, MC Maluleke from RRC. He used to come here at Charis, bought us a anointing water and which is work for us and t shirts. Hesh. <laughs> Oh, I was praying, praying. <laughs> the reason why I came here, I'm working as a contract, and then and the contract is ending my end of March. So I need God to help me to get a permanent job at the same company where I'm working. No, I I my even I want God to heal my mom. Also, peace at my family because there's a lot of fights. Not exactly, but there's no peace. No, like you, they are not talking to each other. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's affected me a lot. Not not only me. Even if my sisters, my younger brother, because there's no peace. Yeah. Before I told him anything, he just prophesied me about the job. That he, what happened? He asked me what happened with your job because I see you not working. Yo, like it's give me a very big shock because yes, it, that's the very big reason why I'm here. And then he just prophesied me about the job. But he, he say God is going to give me a permanent job and I'm very much excited about it. The second prophet, uh, the second prophecy that I get, he say I'm going to get a marriage and then talk about what is happening at home. Yeah, ish. Yeah, I thank God for it because, yeah, I've got the solution of all the problems that I have. Ah, he said, uh, he told me, yeah, I didn't tell him anything. So, God, you two children with different fathers, and then I confirm about it. But he said, I mustn't worry about that. God is going to give me a marriage. Hey, yeah, I was praying for that. <laughs> for that, I think, uh, three years back, yeah. I was praying for that, yes, that God must give me a marriage. I'm very much excited because God has been answered all my prayers. Yeah, I thank God for that. Yes, God of Charis is still doing it even today. <laughs> I can say everyone who have problem came to Charis. God is doing it even today. Yes, yeah, you can come. Hallelujah. Amen. I'd like to thank God for blessing me with a permanent job. I went to one-on-one -on, -one on the 11th of February. Prophet Andres prophesied me and said, your job is coming. I was under the new contract since 2021. I said your permanent job is coming. I've been working on contracts since 2021. I would like to thank God for blessing me with a job. Hallelujah. Amen.